Welcome back to the FCL Kitchen and back to Meatless Monday recipes from our friend uh, Jasmine. That's right. Yeah, I, I try to pretend that I did all this, but she's the we master know she chef does it. <laughs> behind these dishes, and it simply I'm simply the conduit. And today's recipe was inspired by our trip to Michigan. Nice. We stopped at a bunch of different farms, and they have little markets out in front of their their basically their house. Yeah. So we picked up all kinds of fresh produce, like this beautiful spaghetti squash right here. If you've never seen one of these, very nice. So that's what this dish is inspired by. We're making creamy roasted, I'm sorry, spaghetti squash with a creamy roasted red pepper sauce. Perfect. Um, so this, as you can see, is only half of the spaghetti squash. I've already cut it because the first thing you got to do is you got to cut this thing in half. Now, it's it's actually uh, because it's such a big one. Please be careful. This is one of the, one of the hardest parts of actually okay. making this dish is cutting the spaghetti squash without cutting yourself wide open. Got it. So cut it down the middle. Take some drizzles, a little bit of olive oil and salt on it. Okay. And you basically roast it. I roasted it cut side down. Roast it cut side down See on the pan. It. Got it. For about 30 minutes to 40 minutes. It's all, it's similar to pasta. It depends on how much you like al dente pasta or you want it well done. But you just do about 30 minutes at 400 degrees. Check it. And if the fork goes straight through, like very easily, yeah. then you know it's done. Cool. <clears throat> now, while that's roasting, okay. you make the creamy red pepper uh, sauce, which is right here. Super easy. So here's what you're going to need for the creamy red pepper sauce. All right, a 16 ounce jar of roasted red peppers, uh, two tablespoons of butter, four cloves of garlic, half teaspoon uh, dried basil, freshly cracked pepper, half cup of heavy cream, or if you're vegan like us, you use coconut cream, which is what we used in this one. <clears throat> okay. So you use coconut cream, which is basically uh, a, a half a cup of coconut milk from the can. That Got really it. heavy stuff we've used in some other dishes. Yeah. So, once the, uh, you get the, the, these roasted red peppers right here, put those in a blender, puree them, start garlic and oil in the pan. Okay. And just get the garlic and the, I'm sorry, the butter. Garlic and the butter in the pan going. Then you add the puree of red pepper. Let that go for about 10 minutes and simmer. This smells really good. Yeah. Yeah, well, it has a very strong, strong smell. We had to make this last night because this takes, this takes, this is the, the longest part of it, but. The sauce takes longer than the squash. Oh, well, it sauce takes, no, it actually, it doesn't. Ooh. While that's, that takes 30 minutes, you'll have this done well before that's done. It's got a little kick to it. Yeah, so yeah. it's roasted red pepper. There's no tomatoes. Oh, interesting. Yeah, so okay. it's just roasted red peppers. And so then once it's done about 10, 15 minutes simmered, you add the cream, pour okay. it in there, and it gets that nice vodka sauce color, you know, Got that it. mixed sauce. So once that's finished, you're just letting that simmer. It's heating up. Now your, your squash is done. Pull that out of the oven. Now this is where the spaghetti gets made. This is where the spaghetti gets made. Okay. Everybody doesn't know. So, so done how does this it before? go? No. So I'm going to. Basically, just start at the Come top. On, Curtis. Start at the top with a fork and just drag the fork through like you're raking Ooh, and just good. pull hard. Just like just, this? Just on the surface. Just on just the surface. pull through. Okay. Pull through. There you go. Look and at you, that. Okay. Keep going, keep going, you, and you're gonna clear that whole thing out. And then ah, if you wanna okay. make some room, take some and throw it in the bowl. Got it. Okay, yeah, it's easy peasy. Yeah, I'm just keep right. doing that. There we go. Get some out here, bring that bowl over here, we'll put a little sauce on, quick. So I love this, because now, this is great right, that's for plenty. like, for you those. Don't get, you don't wanna get to eat the whole squash. You uh, get just a little bit, that's your lunch. <laughs> Leave the rest for me. All right. Here we go. <laughs> Here's your sauce. Here's your sauce. She's trying to take all of it. I am trying to take all of it. Hey, I got to bring some home to the good. chef. Okay. If I don't bring okay. some home to the chef, we don't get more meals. <laughs> <laughs> all right, try it. My apologies, chef. All right, we're going to give this a give go. Give it a try. I guarantee you it's going to be better than those Skittle Try it. You're going to love this. Roasted red peppers. By the way, this one mm. is on a website, Budget Recipes. This whole recipe, under 10 bucks. See, that's I, this is what I need in my life. Yeah. This whole Definitely. recipe, under 10 bucks to make, and you can feed a few people. Yeah. There you go. You can find this segment again on our website a little later today, firstcoastliving.net. Get in there. Get some of that. Mm. Oh, that's so good, baby. Yeah, I need, to, I need to get that other flavor out of my palate. <laughs> Definitely. We'll be right back.